Okay, welcome back everybody to Web Gaming Central, and we're going to start working on our fourth power generator, and that's the solar power. So let's get it in a spot where we can really expand on it. The thing about the solar power energy is that it is one thing in particular that you're going to want to always keep in mind is that um, it produces a, very, produces a very low amount of energy, but it does produce more than your wind power plant. The thing is, comparing the two, you have to ask yourself which one takes up more space, and in my particular opinion, that's going to be um, the solar power plant. And let's explain so why. Guys, as we are in the peak hours, although this says you know, the peak hours will be 8 megawatts, we're actually experiencing nearly 12, or actually 12.1. Um, and again, it's during the peak hours. The peak hours are from 5 a.m. to 8 a.m., if I'm not mistaken. And uh, so, yes, as you can see, we're pretty much powering the city pretty well what we will do is speed up time to get to nighttime so you can see when we're running on battery power but while we're here let's go take a look at the um, modules so let's place this guy and first of all the fixed solar array these are what you start off with and as you can see the cost initial cost of these are high but the the hourly uh, payment or charge is much low than everything else on offer so is two knocks against this is the the solar that is is that it takes up so much space and it's costly so starting off with solar energy can be a challenge okay just want to get that out there now as you see we're running with 36.2 we're producing I'm sorry 36.2 now that's in the peak hours so let's fast forward to get past that okay now as you guys can see we're past 8 o'clock now we're down to producing 12.1 megawatts of power okay so we have all three and where with the one we were producing uh, the same amount 12.1 now we're down to producing 11.8 with with all three now yes that's a problem <laughs> depending on how you look at it but at the same time you know if you want clean energy this is by far one of the better ways to go um, then again, there's the pros and there's pros and cons that you know work for both wind power and solar power. So the choice is yours. But let's, after some research, of course, the fixed solar array, you can um, get that as well. Um, you have to unlock it though with the education. But as you can see, when you place one of those guys, um, you get 35 added, if I'm not mistaken. Mistaken. So these are good very good but the, the entry cost is high but at the end of the day you know if you have the money it becomes feasible because your monthly I keep saying monthly your hourly cost is much low lower than the alternative options so guys this can be a viable source if you have room in your city and if you uh, have the simoleons to spare so that's a brief uh, rundown on the solar energy so guys thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video